Hey guys, welcome to Let's Go Catch a Snap. So today we're going to be working on the electrical here. And right now I just crimped this uh, terminal here, the electrical terminal. And then we're going to heat trick it right here to protect it from all the, uh, you know, the elements of the water or what may have you here. See how it shrinks right into place here. See everything that's marine, you have to make sure that you, uh, you know, put enough covering so all this will not by any means get any uh, water in it. Okay, then we're going to connect this right here like this, and then we're going to see what's going to happen. Stay tuned. Something that's very important, guys, when I do electrical on uh, any type of device, especially on marine devices, I make sure that I solder my connections at all times so see I soldered the point of this I'm gonna solder now the point of this one here okay I want to make sure that everything is soldered so you know there's nothing coming loose with the vibration of the boat or whatever may have you so stay tuned all right so all I do is get the my gun here and we're gonna solder this here and the reason why I'm doing this because when this crimps onto the uh, connector itself it's not going to bend up and all that and it's going to give me a good tight fitting here guys so i'm just going to solder this like that all right put some solder in there just like this everything here is done to a professional grade i do not want any and then finally what i'm going to do here guys is right here where i soldered this at where i got the splice I'm just going to stick this in here just like that, all the way as back as I can, all right? Get it right in there, make sure there's no water at all that's going to penetrate through that. And then I'm going to heat shrink it. Want this, this is going to close it up. It's going to keep all the water and everything, moisture, whatever may have you, from going into this. Now, obviously, you know, a lot of people that do live wells are not going to take all this time and you know effort into their thing but for me you know it's well worth it guys I, I don't want any problems in the ocean I don't I don't want to you know kill any of my bait or anything like that so anyway so that's it so we got the heat shrinking tube already on here we have this now the next thing we need to do is get another of one of these terminals that I am going to connect here um, with the power wire and um, then I'm going to power this up. And uh, from there, we're going to go into. Uh... Into the box. Okay, and then we'll have the light work. Okay, stay tuned.